I'm also gonna make some shrimp egg rolls. So, so we are getting ready to go to the beach. Ela me deixa só ficar na vontade Manda foto, sinto gosto e apago Finge que eu nunca tô na maldade Mas na minha mente só eu sei a verdade Sendo aquele que dá tranquilo Ok, y'all, I figured today I'd do this vlog a little differently You know, it's no, it's no secret that life has been lifing lately So I figure, hey, let's just talk about it, okay? Let's talk about it Right here, y'all can see some of the groceries it got, and and I just, you know, I, you hear me? Did you hear me stuttering over my words? I'm not going to edit any of this out. You know why? I don't feel like it, and that's just mood. Like that is just mood for 38. Tomorrow is my birthday, and I'm <laughs> I'm just done. I'm just done stressing. Look at my babies. Like look at them. Like, how could I stress? I'm done, like, being upset about things. I'm done letting things trigger me. I'm done. The things in my life and the people in my life right now are here for a reason. It really, really, really hurt me when the tree fell on my house. It really did. I'm not going to lie. My garden, everything. But, you know, God has given me so many do-overs. Like, over and over and over. I lost my shop. We got to start over. Who? How many people can pack up? move to a different state and start all over on several companies on top of adding more children see as much as y'all be confused about how how are you doing this with all these kids let me tell you <laughs> i am confused too like i don't know but it's god like it, it can't be nothing but god and the fact that me and my husband just kind of refuse to give up on each other he's my person i'm his and I'm not going to say we haven't had our down and outs and our almost theirs and our almost uh -uh, forget you and forget you too but nah, like at the end of the day, it's not, nope, it's always, we're going to be solid. That's just, that's where we are. And, and that along with just life and the way my life works, that's just how God works in my life. Like I just realized that no matter what, I'm going to be good. So all the stress, all the negativity, all the, every extra thing that we do as women, when we overanalyze and we have these I don't know if y'all have intrusive thoughts where you like laying in bed at night and all of a sudden, oh, bam, one of my kids get hit by a car. Yeah, I know. That's crazy, right? That's part of my bipolarism <laughs> and my anxiety. And it's, it's you can laugh at trauma if it is what it is. But, you know, I'm done with that. I'm done. I'm done. I am so done. I'm ready to be free at 38. I am almost 40. And I'm happy to say that. Like for the first time in my life, like I, when I was almost 30, I'm like, oh, my gosh. Now that I'm almost 40, which I'm almost 40. Like, that feels good because my life is yet to be completely lived. My, business are go my businesses are going well and everything's going great. It's going in the direction that I wanted to go in and it's because I am working for that. So with that being said, if your life is not, you know, where you want it to be or doing what it, you want it to do right now, yo, all you got to do is just change it. I'm sorry, that was a car going through the background. All you got to do is and you can still hear y'all y'all still hear it little man big ego anyways all you got to do is change your life okay that's all you got to do but that's the end of the grocery haul i'm getting long-winded all i want to let y'all know is life is good i'm good over here if i go silent i'm sorry but i'm good all right hope y'all good too so we just got back from grocery shopping i guess i'll show you you know people always want to know um <laughs> what the fridge looks like after you stock it so I guess I'll show you do you want to see that I'll show you but yeah this is just how we stored it like it's that's it's a light on anyway. there we go all right so yeah this is how we stored it fruits and veggies at the top what the kids can get to is the first thing they see when they open and that's my favorite thing and I always keep my green onions and some water we've got almond milk we already had that coffee creamer or jello that's their dessert for tonight they're all going to split it um what's back here fruit cups beer Diet tea, corn, gluten free. Y'all see, y'all see. I've already gone over this. That's where our waters are. Um, desserts, meats, and condiments. Mommy, yes. Can ice cream? Um, we're not gonna have ice cream right now. No, I want juice. Yes, you can have the juice. Hold on, move your hand. I'll get it. Juice. There you go. No, you must try. You try. What? Candy? 
We have a gummy. You want a gummy? Okay. Let <laughs> so me set it up. Say thank you, Dylan. Ian, say thank you. And Carter, yes, now you can have your chip. I'm going to write it down. I'm going to write it down. Jeez. There you go. There you go. All right, so I'm about to make some uh, shrimp egg rolls, all these cords, because I'm charging all the kids' devices over here. That is what it is. So I'm going to make some butter rice for the kids. I'm also going to make some shrimp egg rolls some will be like i haven't washed any of this you see the stickers are still on, are still on and i have to uh, rinse these under cold water because they're frozen um some will be shrimp like fajita style and then some will just be just plain shrimp for my other picky eaters but yeah this is all i need and then i'm gonna air fry some broccoli you want chippies okay um we got their chips we always get them their own and what they eat is what they eat. And if they're gone at the end of the week, they're gone. So this is what she's gonna get. And I'm gonna put hers in a little bag because she will sit and eat all of them. Oh, excuse me. We're gonna put some in a bag here, okay? Let's get a bag. Get a bag. How many chips do you want? Do you want five or 10? What, you want a snack bag? I'll get you a snack bag. Let's get five chips. You want to get five? One, two, three, four, five. I gave you seven. There you go. Open it up. You write your name on yours. It'd be easier if I had my big marker like I have at home, but it's all right. They'll see it. I have it written everywhere. Dylan. Dylan. Dylan, Dylan is everywhere. All right, so this is gonna take a few seconds to defrost. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, run it under some cold water. It will, you know, tails off everything. It'll go ahead and defrost really quickly. I got my peppers and onions and garlic. I put these here to remind myself to put in an air fryer. And so I'm gonna saute all this up, season these shrimp up really well and um, cook these, but before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and put the broccoli in the air fryer and get the rice started because that's gonna take the longest. So let's do that. I'm gonna go ahead and sit these in some cold water and then get my sides going. Yes, I'm eating pork rinds because they are gluten-free and five grams of fat and less than one gram of carb. And they have so much protein, so absolutely I need them. All right, now I'm gonna add two tablespoons of butter. Let's move those out the way. And now I'm gonna turn it on. I did that for a reason. I didn't want it to be hot. I want it to all come together, together. And I usually, I don't know why I'm showing off for y'all. I usually put it right in the middle. So there you go. Let that heat up. All right. Grab my spoon. There's about a tablespoon of butter. And you just start letting it toast. And as that butter starts to melt, I'm going to add in some of that crushed garlic in the bottom. Like I said, this is how I make my rice. Just a little bit. Keep stirring. You don't want your rice to burn. And then I'm also going to add in, where'd I put it? Oh, here it is. Hold on. Got to keep stirring. I don't want the rice to burn. I want it to cook. Let me 
put in a half a bouillon cube. Just half of it and sprinkle it in there. That's all you need. Go back to stir. Drain these and put some water. And this is cold water, remember? Just let them sit. Our rice is over here starting to do its thing. So once it starts bubbling, you turn it down the low and put the top on it. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay. Now let's get these uh, veggies sauteed up. One, two, three, four. There's four left. So I'm going to use about two tablespoons of this when this is completely done. All right, let's do the broccoli. I usually use regular broccoli, the pumpkin, the air fryer, I'll let you use frozen. You don't know me. My grandmother cut everything with a wooden knife, and so I do it too. All right, we got our frozen broccoli in there, and let's season it up. And we're going to just cube it up. My husband will hear right now. He'd freak. Babe, stop doing that. Listen, my grandma cut things in her hand. <laughs> so I'm going to cut things in my hand. Best lady in the world. Truly. And my TT. And my mama Dotsy. And my aunt Reen. Just good, good people. And my cousin Shayna and my sister Amber. I got some good people. All right, so we got that in there. We're gonna put some more of that garlic that we had chopped up. That's why I chopped up so much garlic, y'all. Some of that in there. And a little bit more for good measure. All right, yes, I'm still gonna put garlic powder even though there's garlic in there because we just like it. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of salt, just some pink Himalayan. And, oh, it drives me crazy. Because I know when I go back and cook on this, so if there's sneeze, seasoning on the eye, it's gonna have that burn smell. I'm actually gonna put um, a little bit of adobo, and I just saw we have some bacon. I'm gonna put some bacon. All right, I'm just gonna put one piece of bacon. You only need one piece, and then we'll chop it up. And I'm just going to chop it up roughly and just sprinkle them on there. Add a little pizzazz to the broccoli. Why not? Bacon makes everything taste greater, right? Somebody going to say, it's not good. I know. I know. Moderation. One piece of bacon. Moderation. Judge your mother. All right, let's put it on here. Pop this in the air fryer. That looks good. Um, let's pop it in the air fryer. All right, now it's time to show that you make your husband earn his paycheck because you're about to use all the paper towel in the house for this part. I don't know why. I just like doing it with the paper towel. It's just easier. But you want to lay this flat, okay? Do not make the mistake of making this and then keeping all this water in it and, and seasoning it. Pat these things dry first and then season them. I promise you it will make a big, big difference. So we're gonna put them on here after they're all, you see they're all defrosted, lay them out flat and then we're gonna pat them dry. I'm gonna show you how much water is left when y'all just season them in the um, bowl and pour them in there. And so that's why sometimes you get like slurpy, sloppy shrimp. Pat them bangs, they like to be dry. They want the season to stick to them. That's how they get plump. All right, look at that, look at that water left in there. All right, I'm gonna press on the top. So much water in shrimp, y'all. Don't press too hard, you don't want gummy shrimp. All right, now that they're dry, now we're gonna season those up and leave those to the side for a second. 
easy seasoning, adobo, of course, always. And I'm only gonna season one side, my kids in particular. Garlic, of course. And paprika, and that's it. Oh, maybe some parsley, cause parsley makes it pretty. Let's get these vegetables done first. Turn that on. Pop some of that oil in the pan. All right, let's go ahead and put our garlic and onions and peppers all together. That's just how I do it. I'm reaching over the camera. That's why it's taking me so long. And everything's being done in a different way lately. Still getting done. Still making meals for my family. Let's check on our rice. Mm-hmm. See that? I can go ahead and throw that butter in. It's almost done. Looks so good. I'm going to roll this to the side. I never said this was healthy. Got that broccoli. Mmm. So good. And it's got that bacon on it. It's so good, y'all. Well, they don't have a top, so I'm putting this over it. Slide it to the back. Alright, so let's get this broccoli out of here because we're going to need this air fryer. Can I wait, y'all? Yummy. Get that bacon. Oh, that's gonna be so good. This is getting out of hand. I know. I know. Seatbelt, sir. I'm going. I'm going. Um, what's that, sir? Did you grab my jacket? Did you grab my jacket, sir? I'm sorry. Come, hurry, sir. Wait, go back. Ah. Lonzo, you gotta grab the drugs, buddy. That's like. Such a rookie move. Sorry, sir. Can I? I'm in this house, I'm feeling at ease. Find a photo, see if you like it, I'll pay. I'm sure that I'm not in love with you. But I'm in my mind, so it's the truth. Being that guy that gives you tranquility.